Hello, so today we're back with the side hustle cash stuffing that I have been saying I'm going to do. Um, now, I, I'm going to be just totally honest with you. I've always been honest throughout this channel, but this one I really did back and forth about. Um, ultimately, this channel, this, my TikTok profile, everything was just to document my journey with cash stuffing. And I have to admit, this is a lot more money than I'm used to dealing with. And it's happened in a very short amount of time. So I was toing and froing whether I should do this on camera or not. Um, whether people would think, I don't know. I, I, I'm just clearly quite uncomfortable <laughs> with this amount of money. Um, and you know what? That's been my whole problem. That's how I've got into debt. That's why I've had to start budgeting because I have always been uncomfortable with excess money. It's I'm the sort of person that when I get money, I immediately find something to spend it on. I'm not like, oh, yay, let's save it. I just it goes like water through my hands like it is been a problem. So I am doing this because this is going to be an honest journey about, you know, how I financially grow and my relationship with money. So I just wanted to preface it with that, as well as so many of you have bought binders, have supported me. And I I just can't even put into words how grateful I am and how much you're changing my life, clearly. Um, and also, I wanted to put in here, not that I, I don't know how many people are going to see this. But if you have bought a binder, I have been spending every single minute I have to make them. Um, it is turned into a full-time job more than a full-time job and I'm working as fast as I can to get them out to you um in fact while I'm talking about it let me just show you the cheaper binder that I sell wait here this is the other binder that I sell it does come in pink as well um as as lilac and you can change what color this is and what color the envelopes come in so just for example that's how it looks on the inside hopefully you can see that but I love this. I think it's very Mean Girls vibe. Um, and I just really love them. And you've been buying lots of these. So I really am trying to get them out as fast as possible. Currently, it's around 7 to 14 business days for me to ship them out. And I promise you, promise you, I'm working as fast as I can to get them out. So um, thank you so much um, for your patience. I obviously wasn't expecting... I wasn't expecting to sell these. Otherwise, I probably would have made them... <laughs> easier to make to be totally honest with you but um enough of that we're going to get into counting the cash um and stuffing it so thank you so much for watching so let's pop those off to the side and bring this in now like you know me i'm not the best at counting cash so let's just go with it i'm going to use the calculator more as a case of keeping tabs rather than helping me add up but let's start with the 50s so 50 100 150 200 250 300 350 400 so we've got 400 in 50s so 400 plus next up i'm going to count the 20s 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 80. 9, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000. So I'm just going to pop this off to the side. So that's 1,000 there. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20, 40, 60, 85. 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89. So that's 900 there. So that's 1,000 
900. Let's hope I got that right. I did have a bit of a meltdown in the middle and a fly or so threw past very rudely halfway through the counting, which threw me off as well. I'm just going to split this because that's a bit full. Okay, now to do the tens. Ten. Oh my goodness, that's not a good start, is it? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So that's 250. So did I press that? Plus 250. I don't know whether splitting that up makes any difference, but... And now the five. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 105, 110. So uh, plus 110 is 1,660. Now, yeah, I've definitely got the 20s wrong there because I think there's 2,560 here. So, you know, true to Barbie Budget's form, got it wrong. But I'm convinced there's 2,560 there. First of all, we're going to do the cash envelopes. Now, since my last video, I have added in a new envelope into this one. I've also put a new envelope into my uh, sinking funds envelope too. So the first one that we're going to do today is rent. And we're going to put 500 into rent. So 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, that's 400 and then one, two, three, four, five. That's another hundred. What have we already got in here? I am going to do trackers. I'm vowing that in my next video, I will have my trackers. It's just been so busy. I haven't wanted to focus on anything else other than the orders. So 100, 200, 300, 400. One, two, three, four, five hundred. Um, sorry, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, five, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, six. So that's six hundred in there now, which is fifty more than I thought was in there, but th which is why I need trackers. <laughs> I can't remember what goes in, what comes out. So I clearly just need trackers. So that's now got 600 in for rent and we need 1,150. Um, so we've still got time to build that up. Bills, Bills is gonna get 200 today. So I'm gonna do that in 20s as well. So 40, 60, 80, 100, 40, 60, 80, 200. Oh, it's not very aesthetic, is it? Someone's written on that. Now, I'm trying out this new holder. I don't know if it's uh, going to stay or not, but we're giving it a go. So in bills, we now have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60. So 260 in bills. As with all my bills and the rent especially that builds up in here and then it gets deposited back into the bank because this has all come from the bank um for me to actually pay my direct debits i pay my direct debits and rent just like everybody else does that's one of my number one questions that i get but this helps me manage it and physically see it and most importantly not spend it while it's in my bank on amazon prime and deliveroo because they're who gets most of my money speaking of who gets most of my money this little guy, this little cub, this little angel in dog form, Pablo. <laughs> the one of the mo one of the most commented things I get on TikTok is how much I spend on Pablo's food. And a lot of people have recommended tails.com and they've said, What the hell are you feeding him? So that sparked me to do some research. Now I did go on to tails.com, like a lot of you said. But he has, the reason why it costs us so much to feed him is he has a lot of skin issues. So he doesn't eat chicken, 
he would if he could but we don't give him chicken because that seems to irritate his skin more and we try and get grain free but it's not always possible and we've been having to go to pet's corner every week and get what we can because the food's always out of stock with brexit and all of that boring stuff um it's just been a nightmare getting his food and very expensive after doing some research i actually placed an order with bella and duke now they're a subscription service i don't know if any of this is interesting by the way if it's totally not interesting <laughs> let me know in a nice way but um i just thought i'd share this with you because i've obviously struggled with this and i want to give the best care to pablo that i can so we place an order with bella and duke which are a raw food subscription service now um we got his order the other day he had his first uh food from it this morning and he seemed to absolutely love it i've not seen any side effects just yet but you know, sometimes there's like a little bit of a switch when going or a transition period going from kind of processed food over to raw food but he's been totally fine so far but i will keep you posted and i've actually got a code for you it's a referral code i'm not affiliated with them in any way but um if you use that code and you want to try it for your dog or cat then you get 50% off your first box. So our box was £35 for 24 days of um, food for him. Now he's about 30 kilograms, our dog. So he's fairly big. You'll get 50% off. But also, if you use our code, you'll um, basically be giving £20 to Pablo's food. So we get a referral bonus, which is I thought was so lovely. So if you did want to try it out, I'd love it if you could use our code. No worries if not. But if so um that will help with our pablo food costs so in that same vein i'm going to be putting 80 into pablo because now this is going to turn more from food costs um now that we're bringing that down um to saving things for vet costs because our insurance is also bad so also if anybody has any insurance um recommendations for dogs please let us know because i feel like we pay way over the odds um i don't want to do tens here need to concentrate so um 20 40 60 80 yeah if you have any insurance um recommendations please let us know so 20 40 60 80 90 in pablo i'd also like to save to get him an allergy test um and we're also saving to get him done don't tell pablo but we would like to get him done hopefully that will help him calm down a little bit we're not looking to breed from him so yeah starting to save for that that was a very long story about pablo there hopefully that was interesting petrol is gonna get oh my god that is not petrol that is food food is going to get 100 so 100 that's 60 80 i'm gonna do two tens here So that's 100 in there because i've been working so much i must admit we've been getting a lot of takeaways and delivery because i haven't wanted to spend time cooking i've just wanted to be able to fulfill all your orders which is taking time petrol is going to get 20 i'm just going to put a 20 pound note in there In beauty, I'm going to put 100 into beauty because um, I haven't had my lashes done in a while. My last appointment got cancelled. So next time I get them done, it's probably going to be a full set um, and save with my nails. That's another point. I got my nails redone today because the, those pink ones I had had all chipped and were awful because I didn't go to my usual lady. I've gone to my usual lady and I love them. So I must book in advance. Otherwise, I'm going to be sorely disappointed and end up spending more money, which is not what we want to do. So 100 into beauty and I'm going to do 60 in 20s and then um, 30 in 10s. So that's 90 there and I'm going to do 10 in 5s. So what have we got in here? Just the 10. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 and 10. In health, 
I'm going to put 150 in here because I need to be saving for the dentist and uh, that's not a fun expense is it but it, it it does need to be done I think I'm due about five fillings would you bloom and believe it I didn't even have some that long ago um and it's not because I'm not brushing my teeth let me tell you that I've got braces unless you can <laughs> if you can tell by the way that I speak but uh that wasn't enough uh it's because I had these silly fissure sealings on my teeth and um sometimes so I spoke to the dentist and they're like yeah sometimes it can really help and sometimes yeah it can make it a lot worse for people I'm like why did you give them to me then very annoyed about it it's a sore subject um 20 40 60 80 100 20 40 50 so that's 150 into health oh i didn't count this so that was 150 plus another 10 so 160 okay miscellaneous is going to get 30 because there's nothing in there at the moment so i think i'm going to do that in yeah two tens and two fives just because with miscellaneous you never know what you're going to need so fives are always good to have in there and then household this is the new envelope that i added um it's it's not cut the best so that's what i don't actually use this particular vinyl for the orders that i send you guys out um yours is like a, a simple pink vinyl and it's really nice and um cuts better than this one um so household is going to get 20 now for household what I mean by that is like washing stuff cleaning stuff things that aren't food but you would buy at the at like Tesco's or something so that's the cash envelope stuffed and that's probably the fullest they've been in a little while so that feels nice and now we're going to move on to sinking funds so emergency fund giving a good run at that um with this money here so we're going to put 300 into the emergency fund um what should we do that so let's do 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 40 60 83 so that's 300 I can't tell you the feeling of like security. I don't know if you've ever heard of the hierar Maslow's hierarchy, um, but it's basically at the bottom, you've got like your needs and stuff, your basic needs as a human and then um, like extra things that you would need. But at the bottom, there's this basic um, level of needs. And this really ticks that box for me. This is just like that um, safety net that I've never made a conscious effort to have. So it's a nice feeling. I highly recommend everybody do this. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 50. So that's 450, 460, 470, 480. That's 480 pounds in the emergency fund. Oh my God. Why is that not going down? Little bend, little dog ear in that note there. Wow. Halfway there almost to my goal, which is a thousand saved up. And then I can start really putting things towards debt. So the idea is you have your emergency fund and then anything that comes up, you then don't have to use credit cards. Not that I can use mine anyway because they're all maxed out and haven't been paid for a while being totally honest with you um as i always will try to be um the idea is you have money here travel that is going to get 200 now as i said we're going to a wedding abroad next month so this is really going to need to get some serious help so let's add that 200 in 20 40 60 81 
Okay. 20, 40, 60, 81. Oh my God. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Um, that was 300, wasn't it? 305. That's nice to have. It's definitely going to need a bit more because we are going to Italy. And I don't know what that is. What is that? So 305 in there. In Christmas. Oh, <laughs> I haven't got my pen out. Let me just get my pen. But you know, this is my favourite one. So for Christmas, we are, we've got our Christmas challenge. I'm doing 500. Sorry, I'm doing 800. Let me get my pen. So today we're going to be adding in 55. So I'm going to do two 20s, a 10 and a 5. I'm going to colour in one of these. So you can get these from my shop, which will be linked, um, and they come in 250, 500, 800. And I know someone's asked me for a thousand, which I keep meaning to do. I've just been so busy. I haven't had a chance, but um, I will get around to adding a thousand on there. But you'll still have time to complete this before Christmas. And if you do it, if you double up on a couple of weeks, then you'll still have it at the beginning of December. So you have time to do your Christmas shopping. Twenty. Ooh. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65. So that's 265 pounds for Christmas. And it is August still. And that is, that's a good feeling. That is a good, good feeling. Um, these are laminated. So I've used Sharpie on there, but you can get it off with rubbing alcohol or nail varnish remover which is handy okay and i say rubbing alcohol is actually what is this isopropanol propanol um but in the us they call it rubbing alcohol in gifts i'm going to put 10 in gifts so we've got 10 15 20 25 30 I don't have any plans for this money, so just adding to it slowly is helpful. The next one is shopping, and I'm going to add £45 to shopping. Um, I'm going to probably need to get some new clothes soon. I haven't really bought any new clothes over the pandemic, and I've been living in leggings and bras without a wire now <laughs> for like a year and a half, or however long it's been, and I desperately need some new clothes. So I think the shopping budget is going to go towards that. So I'm going to put in, um, oh, not that. I'm going to put in 45. Now, my favourite place to shop is like ASOS. So I might, what I might do is go to the shop and actually buy a gift card. Um, just so I can budget that. I don't know. 20, 30, 40. 550 in shopping which as most of you will know doesn't really touch the sides when you're close <laughs> shopping so that will be a, a slow and gradual build i'm sure business um isn't going to get anything debt also isn't going to get anything but you know who is going to get something the tax man we're going to put some money in tax today also i didn't show you but i've got a new envelope in here um, I actually did this on TikTok because it was just this envelope that I was stuffing. But um, I had a new car envelope because I don't have a car at the moment. And my dad gave me a birthday card, a belated birthday card with £250 in it. So that went straight into there. Um, but I won't be adding to that today. It, this is all just going to be tax, which is heartbreaking. So let's see how much is going in. 20 40 60 80 
one, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60. So that's six, 60 there, six, 60, six, 70, 80, 90, 700, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. So that's 790, 800, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. So that's 870, which isn't right. I was going to only put um, 750 in, unless I didn't count that right. But... Mm, let me just double mm, goodness 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 if if not i don't know what i've done unless no i really don't know i, I must have mucked something up here because that's not what i budgeted for at all god you guys must be so sick of my shit at this point like you mu honestly just must be so sick of this um 20 40 60 81 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60. Right, so is that actually 560? That's where I went wrong. So 560. 570, 80, 90, 100, 600, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 600, <laughs> 610, 620, 630, 640, 650, 660, 670. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on here. Not a clue. Literally none. Whatever is here, I don't know, is going into tax. I, I, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm, I could be here all day trying to figure it out. I'm probably going to have to watch this back. If any of you saw what on earth has happened, then, you know, let me know. I will get better. I've been saying I'm going to get better since I started and it's yet to happen. But um, whatever that is, who knows what this is, is all going to the tax man. Um, I am just say, trying to save 30% of what I stuff now into tax. So that um, I have it because I've not done that before. And I'll be honest, my last two tax bills are outstanding, which isn't great. But um, yeah, I'm going to save 30% and get in the habit of that. Now, what will happen is, as you can see, that is quite full. Um, when each folder gets to a thousand, I might even do 500 for some of them because I, I don't want too much money in here. I will then be putting that into online banking. And I also have a system that I'll be showing you in my next video, hopefully, of how I keep this Barbie budgets theme online too. So if you're someone that doesn't want to do cash stuffing or you do a mix, whatever, you can still do Barbie budgeting online so that's exciting but that is again the fullest that that's ever been as well so i just want to end this video by saying again so grateful if you want to get yourself a barbie budgets binder or one of the um mean girls themed binders i mean they're not really mean girls themed they just give me that kind of vibe then you can get these from the link in my description oh my god sorry i was just choking there um you can get these from the link in my description um but yeah thank you so much and i can't wait to show you in my next video my budget trackers and how i then put this money into my online banking so thank you so much and i hope you have an amazing rest of your day